Hello, in this week's video we're looking at the Rehearse with Coach feature which is now available in the browser-based version of PowerPoint. So if you click open up your PowerPoint, click on Slideshow, you'll find the Reverse with Coach, Rehearse with Coach, as opposed to Reverse, Rehearse with Coach, so we'll click on that. And then down here in the bottom right hand corner we've got a Start Rehearsing. If you don't have a mic, it'll tell you that there's no mic connected. So we've got a mic connected. So we hit start recording. And then you just go through and present as you would normally. So we're talking about the slide. This session, we're going to be looking at logging on to Chromebooks. This is the logon for the Wi Fi. This will bring up a second screen that you'll need to log on. And you can talk your way through the slide. Keep clicking as you go. So it's giving a prompt, I'm talking a bit too quickly, so I can just slow down that. It's suggesting that I shouldn't make too many noises other than the words that I'm trying to say. So cut out on my mmm and my uhs. And on this slide, I've got a number of images linking. So I'm just pretending that I'm presenting and then if they click on the little icon in the top corner, they can log on to Microsoft Online. And once logged on, they can see all of their apps available. So I finished my presentation. I can exit that. It will then give me a rehearsal report so we can see good job rehearsing. So it will tell me total time spent was 1 minute 24. Slides rehearsed were 7. You avoided reading the slide text aloud. That's good for keeping the audience engaged in the message. So it's telling about originality. Pace. You kept the pace just right, which was great. So it tells me about the pace. Average pace over time. No sensitive phrases, so I didn't say anything that was inappropriate or too specialist. Uh, and then finally, to sound more polished and confident, try to avoid using filler words. Pause and take a breath and relax. Some words to avoid, mmm. So there you have it, and you can click learn more, and it'll load up a page and give you more information. So there you have it, if you've got your students looking to present something, Get them to practice, get them to use the Rehearse Coach feature and that should hopefully help improve their presentation. If you're worried that maybe your lessons are going a bit quick when you're presenting content to learners, then have a go at using the, the Rehearse Coach. Hope you found the video useful. Keep watching, keep subscribing and there'll be more EdTech videos coming along very soon.